Hello and welcome to Red Stapler channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the four quickest way to center your diff using CSS with pros and cons for each method. Ready? Let's check it out. The first and most simple method is to use a flex layout. Simply add display flex and justify content center for horizontal justification and align item center for vertical alignment. The advantage of flex display is you don't need to specify the width and height of the div at all. For example, here's the div that only has the text without any width and height. Flex layout is the quickest way to center multiple elements in a single div. The second method is to use margin auto. It's the quickest solution and very popular. But there's lots of limitation. We can only use this for element that have width defined, have block or table display, and must not have position fix or absolute. Also, we can't use it for vertical align, so it's not quite flexible and should be used for certain scenario. The third method is to use a combination of text align and inline block display. Simply add text align center to parent div and set the child div display to inline block. This will force our div to behave like inline element and therefore subjected to text align center. The difference between this method and margin auto is we don't need the width to be specified, but still you can't use it for vertical align. The final method is to use the 2D transform. First we need to set the element position to absolute, then set top and left to 50%. This will move the div to the center of the screen and then add minus 50% translate for both X and Y to offset the element size. The div will always be at the center of the screen and will ignore all other elements. Very useful if you want to use your div to overlay others, but still you will need to define width and height of the div to make this works. So that's all for this tutorial. If you love this video, don't forget to like or subscribe to support us and stay tuned for the next update. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye.